Today, I will show you a very rare work of the famous Soviet scientist Zinaid Chukhanov who proposed a high-speed carryover gasification method. The method he discovered allowed to make 37 times more productive gasifiers than ever before. For this discovery, he was immediately awarded an academic title becoming the youngest academician in the USSR. He wrote so many works that I got tired of photographing them. Chukhanov worked in the field of underground gasification. He also developed high-speed small gasifiers for cogeneration power plants, I'll show you them one day, and many other things. Chukhanov's gasifiers were a breakthrough and could compete with contemporary Western developments. He designed many gasifiers considered up-to-date even by modern experts. Today, the high-speed gasifiers he designed could easily solve Ukraine's energy crisis. They could, for example, make gas from milled peat or biosludge to supply it to cogeneration plants. It would be enough just to replace the burners. The management of Ukraine's state energy company has been offered these options several times, but in 2022 it went its own way deciding to build new cogeneration plants on wood chips and spend other hundreds of millions of dollars on a big construction project. And the state company also decided to burn trash at the existing power plants so that more people would die around them. The company has its own special way of accomplishing big constructions for budget money. Chukhanov lived a long life, he saw the 1917 revolution and World War II. He died in 1986 at the age of 74, several years before the USSR collapsed. Thank God he did not see all that chaos. If you'd like to learn more about this prominent person, follow the relevant link to Wikipedia in the description under the video. In 1939, he was conferred the title of the corresponding member of the Academy of Sciences of the USSR for his theory of carryover of combustible gaseous components from the reaction zone. In the same year, on May 13, he filed a patent together with comrade M. Sagadak. So, now I will show you this patent. This gasifier aims to gasify loose layer agricultural waste, straw, plant stalks, etc. It is known that such a fuel layer may swell during gasification increasing in size by almost 50% and breaking down the gasification process. Chukhanov proposed to prop up the fuel with an auger or piston. The drawing shows an example of such a gasifier. Sheaves of straw, bundles of twigs or reeds up to 1.5 meters long are loaded in its bunker 6. Then the fuel goes from the bunker into chamber 5 by itself or assisted by the endless side belt 7. It is moved from this chamber into the gasifier shaft 4 by auger or piston 8. When the fuel enters the gasifier, a pushing piston or auger cuts it. This is how the fuel is compressed in the shaft and its layer becomes dense making its gasification possible. The compression force determines the shaft filling factor and is regulated by springs 10. The air is blown in the fuel layer through grids 2 and 3. The gas comes out through grid 1. The ash is removed in two methods. The first is that 80% of the ash is simply carried away with the gas. The remaining 20% squeezes out through grid 1 and accumulates in ash collector 12. And don't forget to throw me the gasifier which, or ringing coined my payment details are under the video. See you soon.